So, let's have a bit of a mess around again with a practice restart since people tend to like the restarts. We'll just get into the practice because there is going to be the green jam coming out on the 14th of December. Uh, I think I need less guidance apart from in life. Probably more on that. Uh, let's go with him since it's cold outside. Yeah, luckily, well, luckily or unluckily, where I live is in the middle of a ditch in the lay of the land, so we don't get hit that bad. But it is really windy here today. Tomorrow is meant to be the worst day for us in uh, Cheshire. Give me like negative three. Uh, so who? What color should we go with? Um, we'll go pink for Joe. And we will go with uh, we'll go with that. Uh, try and find something for mining for Remco. Um, can't really find something for mining. We want purple. Okay, we'll go with purple. Yeah, it is more purple, to be fair. It's just on one preview, it's a different. No mining icon, I know. Um, we'll go with that. We'll stake our claim on the mining islands. Bart Fitch. I mean, what about the nines, mines, nines, mines, 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 Bart Fitch. I mean, it's an interesting name. We'll go with Bart Fitch. An itchy Bart. It's, it's gone past a thought. And we're into actually applying it, Joe. Right, uh, we'll just randomize that number for a minute. Unless there is a specific number. Oh, I know what we can do. We'll go with 781987. Don't know why those numbers just came to my, to my mind then. I think we'll go with that. Then we'll go with small islands, small, hard, facility sparse, random. Mm. I've been looking forward to this for a long, long time. Oh yes, you have, Margaret. Um, I'm also going to switch up the music. I'm going to have to test the volume on this, though. So we're going to go with a different band today. It's a band called... Boston Manor. They're from Blackpool. She, she needs to lay off the methadone or, or the whatever she's smoking. So this is a indie punk rock band. From Blackpool. Some of it is punk indie, some of it's a bit heavier, some of it is a bit softer. They're a bit all over the place, which is kind of nice in some aspects. So I'm going to have to adjust volumes as I go. History will They say I'm a... 
Give me feedback on the volume, though. I'll leave it at that. Let me know how it goes. Okay, so we've got the painful tri trio. We'll turn the traders off. They're on hard, as always. And... Hey, punk. How you doing? I'll just adjust that there. Uh, active upkeep. I hope you're having a good weekend. Seems to be missing something. What is it? They're hard, they're off. They're three hardest AI. An eye exam? Well, hopefully it goes smoothly. Is this a regular one? Yeah, I need glasses for distance, and I have a stigmatism in my, one of my eyes, so it's slightly off-shaped. Never had one before. So. Ah, okay. So income is on low. That's fine. That's fine. Let me just check this. Flagship. Yeah, none of this seems to have any effect. Starting oh capital probably. Yes, it's capital. Okay. Uh starting harbour. Do we want a f what do we hey Tuffy, how you doing? Hope you're doing well. What do we want then? Do we want to start with a flagship and find an island, or do we want to start with outer ship and build up from just a harbour? I'm glad to hear that, mate. What have you been up to? Anything of interest? How's the uh, gameplay going? Give myself an island. No ship. Okay, Joe. So we start with an island. No ship. But no boats. Okay. I can do that. I'm also thinking... We might do this the day for this one stream. Um, allowing the trade market, but only for base level materials, nothing constructed. Hey, Petit, how you doing? No winning conditions? Pink kills it in there. Good. Oh, we're in the worst corner. Uh, the game has a memory leak and crashes a lot. Are you running DirectX 12 or 11? For me, DirectX 12 seems to be the most stable for me. DirectX 12. Also, don't run the most recent NVIDIA driver. The last couple of drivers have been awful for the game. Like, awfully bad. I'm using driver 471 point something. Don't go on to any of the 472s. They have an awful deteriorating performance. Stick with driver 471. It's from August.
So what have we got on this island? We have two oil, that's awful, three iron, and two clay pits. So we have some, but we are also in the worst corner, and we have a tiny island. But yeah, uh, what else have I got on? Yeah, Darren X12. I have fixed position on for the sun. Starts crashing once you get to the new world. Mm, yeah, that could be the driver. What system specs have you got? Which one? Yeah, but he was still on the old drivers at the moment. How are you enjoying, or did you enjoy Stellaris? Petit? So we probably want some wood up here, so let's get this up and running. So we're going to get one, two, three, and then we'll do a fourth one here, we'll do storage there. Warehouse here. I need to turn these off actually. I need to turn that off, that off, that off. Let's just build that there. Let's get that rotor there. Let's do a rotor here. Right, that's that road link to that. Okay, well, let me know how you like it, Dean. Interesting. Why is that doing that? Oh. I don't know why that had moved. Oh, I know why. Cheers, Remco, mate. Mm, should be fine on with that system spec which one. 1070 should still be fine for the game if you're running at 1080p. Yeah, it looks like Stellaris has an incredible amount of options and customization. You are right on that. So housing. Let's do this real quick. Yeah, it seems like they definitely let their imaginations run wild in that game from what people have said. Let's just build this here real quick. I need to make sure we build that and then we can upgrade that many. A new milestone. <laughs> All right, Joe. I'll take a minute to catch up, and then we'll start getting wood coming in. Uh, is that the aquatics one? Which punk? I've not tried Stellaris yet. I have Stellaris. I have, like, all the DLCs for it. I literally just bought that new one as well, but I've not actually played it yet. 
I will do. I just don't know exactly when, because I know it's going to be a game that's going to take a decent amount of time and dedication to it. But it's not a quick game that you can literally just pick up and play for an hour or two. I'd be like, oh yeah, I did a lot in that hour or two, from what I've heard. Right, so we can unpause that, and then we'll build another lumberjack there. But the aspect and the amount of information in the game does seem very appealing. Let's unpause that. Then let's build another lumberjack here. Now we've got enough wood coming in, hopefully. Let's actually crank up working conditions on this. I need to get the timber out ASAP. I want to power through the levels. just realized we've got the worst position on this harbor as well. We are literally facing I mean it's a fantastic okay we're going to make the best out of the worst situation here then. Since we're facing this edge of the map which faces nothing it also means that this harbor is fairly safe. It can only be approached from these narrow edges which basically means we're going to have to flip wall instantly whenever we find somebody. We're just climbing wall on everyone instantly then. If the game's going to do that, we're going to fight back by just declaring war on everyone. Hey, Remy, how you doing? And welcome back, Joe. That's not good. Um, let's redo that. Right, that's there. There and there. Okay. So we're going to do an interesting harbour system here. We're going to have to build that here. I'm doing alright, Remy. Glad you're doing well. You got any plans for yourself this weekend? Let's draw that across to there. We'll pause that one. A nice little fishing harbor up already. How quaint. Okay, we're at 75 workers, but they're going to kick in soon with the fish. So we'll definitely hit the 100 very quickly. Where do we want to build the clothing then? Tempted to save up to 20 wood and build a road across here and do farming and agricultural over here. Let's speed this up and get the wood out then. Alright, there's the bridge. 
Yeah. Well, I'll run that across to there. Slow the game down. Let's have a look. I'm not too fussed about reserving space with the rail on this save. Yeah, we could do potatoes or grain on that side. Oh, should we make this really fun? How about we go for a sober playthrough? No alcohol. This is going to get messy really quickly. Hey, Box, how you doing, buddy? Hey, Charlie. Riot stream? Um, it's just happy... Overly happily people, mate. They're just that excited they can't control themselves. That's all it is. I'm doing alright, Bugs, mate. Doing alright. Glad you're doing well. I've actually even started my Christmas shopping. I'm quite actually surprised. We're in November and I already have one, two, three, four or five presents already bought for people. Very odd. Um, I don't know if there's any Black Friday sales actually. But I know I have no idea. Exactly, see, they're that happy they can't contain themselves. Right, workers' clothes coming up. We can't give them out. Ah, oh, man. Now, technically, the pub could just be food. We'll give them the pup, but we won't give them schnapps. We'll just pretend that it's an alcohol-free pup. But we won't provide them with the uh, rum or beer. Juice bar, yeah, exactly. It's a, it's a, it's a fruit juice bar. Control and Q. We have loads of materials coming in. Early prohibition. We're just ahead of the times. Is it possible to build a mega city with that providing happy insights and possible, yeah. It probably wouldn't be the happiest place in the world. But yeah, it's definitely possible. You would probably run into riots and stuff like that, however you could counteract it with happiness boosting items from town halls or people in town halls for boosting that. The biggest problem you're probably going to run across is income. Because the happiness items provide the income. You would have to probably also boost income with items as well. So the probably biggest problem won't be the happiness. It will probably be the actual income. Okay, 
we should be all right on the clothing. That should be kicking in in a minute. Oh, I'm running on super slow speed. That's why it's taking forever. As you can see, because I'm not providing any happiness items, the income is awful at the moment. Putting that down. Just that one item has definitely helped. Yeah, we're getting close on the clothing. Right. Did anyone actually buy much from Amazon this Black Friday? I kind of thought the Black Friday this year was pretty awful on Amazon. Right, let's just put a fire station here. And we'll put a fire station here as well. Let's have a look. How are we doing? We have but they're just they're getting close to taking over. I need to save some of the wood back for upgrading into workers. Because I have an abundance of farmers. Let's see how much wood we can get to before we can start upgrading these. Just hit the upgrade button. How's the music and the volume at the moment? This bit at the beginning is a new song, so it's really quiet at the moment. So we have hit the first resident quest, which should be finding the wolves. You've always ever wished that you can make better what's already gold. There it is. Ocean. I wish I did goose for you. Oh dear. Um. No, we have to pause that. How dare the game give me alcohol? Come on, 99%. We're nearly there. I should probably do that. Uh, max difficulty, no alcohol play. Right, let's update that. Max difficulty, no alcohol playthrough.
Right, these are all ready for upgrade. There we go. There's 130 workers out. So now we can start to look at getting the clay pit up and running. No alcohol. No. No alcohol, man, I'm afraid. Just for the added uh, funsies, mate. You there, you can't go there, but you there, okay, awkwardly placed this, isn't it, right, let's build you there, What are we missing? Okay, eight planks. Right, I need to get a warehouse up as well. Um, so if we put the Tony Blair house here. Hey, hi. <laughs> how you doing, Alex? What flavor gin have you gone for? Or is it just, just regular gin? Not any of this artisanal stuff. Pink gin. Can't go wrong with some strawberries and grapefruit. Right, so now let's just build a road here and here. Right. right let's unpause that. And then let's build another lumberjack hut here. Right, let's crank that up through the roof. Need the uh, bricks out ASAP. I'm going to have the space for another clay pit and brick factories here, so I might do the pig factories here. We're not going to go for a vegan playthrough, because we need the sausages for upgrades. Imagine that, a no alcohol vegan playthrough. Oops, messed up. They need to go this way. Saving a space here for the silo. It's never too early. I mean, it's three o'clock here, Alex. Afternoon warming up tipple. It's cold outside, mate. You need to make sure you're keeping yourself warm. It is freezing, yeah. Right, let's build that. See, you're even an hour ahead, Alex. Right, come on, let's get the wood out. Here, giddy. One, two, three. Austria, I know Austria is awful on its vaccination rates and its COVID. That I didn't even know brothels were a legal thing in Austria. What's that in real temperature box?
16 degrees. Wow. I mean, you're going to have to wear a jacket. Yeah, from, for England, 16 degrees is like, ah, that's not bad. Police on. Will you work your magic for us? What we do, I'd love to see. T shirt work. 16 degrees is still shorts weather for me. I can still go outside in shorts in 16 degrees. A digger? You just ordered a PC and you're going to get it on February, right? I'm reading that correctly, Alex. Right, let's build that. That's a hell of a weight. Yeah, that is a disgusting amount of time to wait, mate. What specs have you gone for? Power supplies. Really? Power supplies are the problem now? Jeez, really? That's insane. Yeah, you can link it, Alex. We make the best of what, what we, we have. have. Yeah, we need more clothing. Right, let's do something about that then. Let's do a silo. Well, I'm going to need extra anyway, so let's have a look at that then. Let's build you here. You there. Space for the silo. There. Uh, let's rotate it so it's facing the same direction. Let's give them their own dedicated warehouse. Fluff it. It's all prepared. Full of food pans and flowers. Yeah, I need to boost income. And I can even show you trolls. You make what's best. Right, let's give you a warehouse here. Give me a second, I'll look at that link in a second. I just need to get this actually while that's kicking in. Why? Hot chocolate in your food order? Ooh. Fancy. I don't think I've actually had hot white chocolate. Um, I need to translate that to English. 30, 80, 1100, 9, okay, 16. Very nice. Nice case as well, mate. That's going to be a hell of a PC, mate. Oh, yeah, I'm not even looking at the press because I know it fluctuates per country, mate. But the specs are good, mate. They can have religion, that's happiness, but that costs it. maintenance, which I don't actually have at the moment. Need more fish balls. Wake me up when you're ready. Hmm. 
not going to say your PC is an anti by the time it actually gets there. Oh. I mean, my CPU is technically an anti. Yeah, Europe prices are a lot higher than America box. An awful lot higher. Right. That's going to fix income. Other than Anno, Alex, what other games are you going to be playing on that? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm at plus 50, Remco. I'm going to have to fix that. Battlefield, try Final Fantasy Online. Oh yeah, your PC will absolutely crush all of that then, Alex, mate. Alright, let's Not put that down. I can people. overclock the steel. Okay, income is screwed again. Honestly, the the no schnapps is killing my income. Like it is absolutely destroying me income wise. No alcohol. Why can't I do schnapps? I added difficulty, mate. For giggles, for entertainment value. Make it interesting, that's all box, mate. Yeah, we're just doing a practice restart, mate. We're trying different difficulties and whatnot. As soon as we find someone that comes into early prohibition, yeah. As soon as we find anybody in the world map, we're also going to be declaring war on them as well. Hey, Gala, how, do do? how you doing, mate? Prohibition didn't work because I wasn't the ruler. I mean, the diplomatic leader. How's your weekend, Galhard, mate? Right, let's have a look at this. Okay, fish is running out. Uh, clothing is running out. Let's get some grain up. What brings you here, Master? Right, you can have silos on you. Hey, Shami. Um, I've played Frostpunk once. Really enjoyed it. I will go back and try Frostpunk again. Uh, so yeah, I have played it once. Enjoyed it. Just free time is not what I have an abundance of at the moment. Very looking forward to uh, the second one. But we will be trying the first one again. Uh, my YouTube has the first day of me playing uh, Frostpunk uploaded. 
So if you want to catch my very, very first experiences of Frostpunk, it is up on my YouTube channel. But I will be trying it again. I can't really remember what happened in the first one. I think we last did a few hours before I got kicked out. How you doing, huh? Hope you're doing well, mate. Right, income is screwed. Right, I need to do something about this real quick. Hold on. Your people can't hold out much longer. Yes, I know. Give me a moment, game. Thank you, game. Clothing of fish. Clothing's fine, fish is fine, that's fine. I just need these to kick in. And then we can get that up, and then hopefully my people won't be at threat anymore. Hey, Nitro, how you doing, buddy? Oh, that was. Thank you for the bits, mate. Asshole. <laughs> Love you, dude. Thank you for the bits, mate. Hope you're feeling. All right, mate. You were under the weather before, mate. I don't think I can... Okay, I'm going to have to pause that for a minute. And that, and that, and that. And we'll pause that. Just so I can get some income in, and I can do some cheeky little upgrades. Uh, done? No. Still got more chaos theory to do, mate. But, as I've got a cracking headache, well, I, mean, a bit of fun, a bit I felt of like just doing Anno, since it's something you can easily fall back on and doesn't require a lot of thinking from many aspects of it. We're just having, we're mixing it up with a bit of Anno again, just to get people back in. And we'll probably pick up, uh, what do we call it? Jurassic World on the next stream. How are you enjoying Game Update 5 in Satisfactory Nitra? You enjoying all the uh, train crashes? Oh, is it? Uh, we'll actually go to a different album since that one seems to have just glitched the hell out. Actually, no, it's playing. No, we'll leave this one running. I, what games are coming out in 2022? Um, I picked up a Stellaris DLC and I picked up the Icarus game. The open world eight player PvE game from Dean Hall that did DayZ. So I bought Icarus. I don't know when I'll play it. Might not be on stream, but because I love DayZ, I'm just going to support De Dean Hall by buying his uh, game. Right, can we... Okay, I need a little bit more steel. How much steel have we got? Not a lot. Oh, Zelda? Which switch have you got? Have you got... To the new LED one, or OLED one, or have you got the the original ones? I know Remco 
played a lot of uh, Breath of the Wild, right? I will play Stellaris at some point, Sir Galahad. I just don't know exactly. The fire left ruins behind. I have all the DLCs. I just haven't got around to playing it yet. Managing copy? work, stream, and YouTube. A photographer raised the settlement. Oh dear. I haven't even come across anyone. Jeez. 